In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix little company boombox controller not working. So please watch the video until the end and follow this tutorial step by step to avoid making mistakes. So let's get started. So to solve the issues with the boombox controller in little company, uh, this issue is common to most players because when they're using their boombox controller while playing, it doesn't work. So to fix this is first, let's try and verify the video player URL. So to do that, you want to open the boombox mod settings within the game. Then check that the URL answered is correct and corresponds to a valid and accessible video or audio source. So if the URL is incorrect, replace it with the correct one and save the changes before trying to use the boombox again. The next step you can do is to simply delete the boombox controller folder. Because sometimes these mod files can become corrupted or outdated, leading to functionality issues. So deleting the mods folder can force the game to create a new, uncorrupted set of files upon the next startup. So to do this, you want to close the game and any related applications. Navigate to the base game directory where the little company.exe is located. Now locate the boombox controller folder. Now delete this folder and restart the game. The third fix we can do is to copy the web address URL directly. So find the music track you want to play on the web. Copy the exact URL from your web browser's address bar. Paste the URL into the appropriate field in the Boombox pod settings and leave all company. Now attempt to play the track again within the game to see if the issue is resolved. The fourth fix we can do is to simply check your internet connection. Ensure that your internet connection is stable and active. If using Wi-Fi, try moving closer to the router or using a wired connection for stability. Now restart your router by unplugging it, waiting for 30 seconds, then plugging it back in and waiting for it to reboot. Now we can also verify the lethal company game file integrity. So what you want to do is to launch Steam and go to your library. Right click on Lethal Company and select Properties. Click on the Local Files tab. Now click on Verify Integrity of Game Files. Now wait for the process to complete and once done, open back the game and check if the Boombox controller is working. And the next step we can do is to check for Lethal Company updates. So just open the Steam client and go to the Library section. Right click on the game and select properties. Go to the updates tab to see if there are any pending updates. If updates are available, allow Steam to download and install them. So after updating, launch the game and test the Boombox controller again. So I hope all of this fixes and fix your problem. So if you find this video helpful, please hit like and subscribe. Thanks.